Peers can also use the constructive confrontation strategy. Uh, peers, uh, like uh, supervisors and stewards, are also concerned about job performance. After all, they work with their coworkers, and if their coworker is in a par in terms of their performance, they're going to suffer as well. In this context, peers do have a real responsibility to talk to their coworkers and encourage them to do well. At the same time that um, peers are concerned about job performance, they have a lot more leeway in terms of how they implement the constructive confrontation strategy. Where the supervisor and steward are really talking about job performance issues most times, the coworker may know other things about what's going on in the family. And very often, they have a comfort level with the employee that they can bring those issues out into the open with the constructive confrontation strategy. What's similar, however, is that the peer, like the supervisor and the steward, are also talking constructively and confrontively to the coworker. They're saying, we care about you. We want to make sure that you're continuing to be here as an employee in this organization, as a union member. You're a valuable, valuable act, uh, uh, resource. Now, at the same time, we're concerned about all these other things that are going on, your job performance, things at home. And we're afraid that if you don't do something about them and do something constructively, like using the employee assistance program, then you know, things are going to be difficult for all of us. So coworkers have a very valuable role to play in today's employee assistance programs. A particularly valuable role if they themselves have used the employee assistance program and have found it to help them and been very successful with it. In those instances, the employee can bring to that conversation a level of credibility that their supervisor and steward cannot bring. So it's very valuable to have coworkers who can talk constructively and confrontively to their peers and encourage them to use those programs.